House prices across the UK up for a second month in a row in a surprise move, according to the Nationwide Building Society, which saw prices rise on the back of restricted supply. Let's take a look at the numbers as they were released for the month of November. 0.2% up, building on the 0.9% increase it measured back in October. At that earlier point, it said that the reason was because fewer and fewer houses were coming onto the market, both new and also resales. Uh, despite a monthly gain, prices are down 2% year on year, but this is still outperforming the expectations of economists who've been looking for a drop of 2.3%. Uh, the latest report comes just days after the Bank of England data showed a leap in mortgage approvals in the month of October. This number out this morning has done wonders for the house building sector. Let's take a look, first of all, at the FTSE 350 Household Goods and Home Construction Index, which is where some of the big uh, builders like Persimmon and Barrett Developments and Barclay Homes uh, reside. And you can see here the punch higher now to levels not seen since the 19th of May this year. And uh, we've got uh, gains across the board. Barclay, which comes out with half year numbers this time next week is up at levels on this market. They're now not seen since January 2022 at £47.19 a share. So big gains for Barclay Group across the board. Uh, we do have a gain today for Redrow, but it's just off the highs recently. But those highs have taken it up uh, most recently to levels not seen since the 8th of February. And in among some of the other companies on the way up as well, uh, we've got highs now not seen since the intraday high Back on the 2nd of May for Taylor Wimpy, another house builder that's showing gains across the board on the back of the strong number out this morning from the Nationwide Building Society.